What's going on everybody and welcome to our tech review. So today we will be doing a review on the Red Dragon M901 wired gaming mouse. The reason I like this mouse is well because I can actually control all my hotkeys on this mouse and so I can worry about moving with the WASD keys on some of my games and focusing on my hotkeys on just the mouse instead of trying to move my fingers up to the numbers on my keyboard and what's cool about this thing is that it comes with the software that Red Dragon provides a link to the download with your purchase and so you can we can pull it up here you can see that you can actually come in and program all of the buttons on the main so you got your right click number two and you can change that to something else left click number one your tab number four here's your tab and then you got your left control left alt and my favorite part about this is that you can control and change all these on the side of your mouse another thing that you can also do is you can mess with the acceleration the pointer speed the scroll speed and the double click speed and you can also adjust the pulling rate if we go on into it you can adjust your DPI along with going in and adjusting the lighting on your actual mouse itself and then when you see when I turn it to green it only changes the logo and the side numbers your mouse wheel still stays red but you come into the breathing and you can see that it only messes with the logo again along with the side numbers the mouse wheel never changes you can also adjust the brightness level and the breathing speed on it next we'll go into the flash so you can see here in a moment it's gonna yep there it goes Boop. back at it <clears throat> next you can go into the info and just tells you you know what version it is the category the model and then all rights reserved to the red dragon zone dot com let's go back to general here you can also save up to five different profiles so if you have five different games and you want to change your numbers to fit how you want to play then you can go ahead and change it and save it and then you can go back in and you can load your files or you can restore if you're messing around with anything like I don't like that hit restore it goes back to where you had your save and if you're messing with it a whole lot like you're first getting out into it you know you're playing around with it you didn't save it yet because you want to test it out you're like I don't like any of this I don't want to mess with it just go back to your reset all and then when you got everything set how you want it just click apply okay and you're good to go but you want to try to keep this app open though so you may just want to keep it minimized so you can get back into it when you're trying it and you can adjust while you're playing I bought this on Amazon April 12th of 2020 and I've had no issues with this so far but I heard different people stories saying you know oh, something breaks within a couple months or a couple weeks you know and they're constantly buying one every couple of months but I haven't had any issues but as of right now they're going for 31.98 on Amazon. I mean they may change over time, prices may drop on a sale. So if you're looking at getting it, I would definitely 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 wait if you're trying to save. But if $31.98 plus delivery doesn't affect you whatsoever, I would say go for it and make that purchase because it is a lifesaver and I really enjoy having it. So, on that note, guys, I appreciate you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.